what's up youtube it's your girl baker becca here we are in sweetwater texas today we are picking up a little oversized load what i like to call them and it's about 10 foot wide and it's going to somewhere in kansas but i don't think they have anywhere to check in here so I'm kind of just waiting copying this guy in front of me but we're picking up a crane boom a crane boom Straps only, no chains, easy peasy. Yeah, we put our dunnage out while we were waiting. It says you're gonna need four to six pieces of dunnage. I imagine four is good, but we're getting an oversized crane boom again. Woo baby! So much for my freaking truck wash in Arizona, man. Go on. Don't be barking at that guard dog. That dog will tear you up. He don't got an ounce of poodle in him. Better watch out, Zeke. Dang. They really did not want to see me win with my truck wash, bro. <laughs> Drinking $130. I just wasted on that shit. Oh, I'm so pissed. Alright y'all, so this is the load right here, this ain't no 10 foot wide, <laughs> I didn't need no permit for this but my brother already bought them so it's so whatever. I got two more things that they're loading on that they're grabbing right now, so I'm gonna start strapping in this mud fest. Y'all, yeah, this shit ain't no 10 foot wide. <laughs> hey, that's better for us though, because then. We ain't got to pay for no, the other permits for the other states. So I guess my brother already paid for the one for Texas. And it was $60. So we're going to go ahead and save that money. If it fits, it ships. Sure, you know what I'm saying? If it fits, it ships, Zeke. If it fits, it ships. I don't know if I got to wait for this dude to get loaded now to back up to get out of here. But... Going to Kansas, people. Up in the cornfields. So much for my freaking truck wash, man. My truck got destroyed. Completely destroyed. Do I gotta wait for this dude? Do I have to back yeah, up? Yeah, yeah, no, wait, 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 wait. Okay. Wait. 
What's up, y'all? So we just slept at a Walmart last night. That was where we were supposed to stage. Um, and we were supposed to call a number in the morning and tell them when, when uh, like we needed directions to the place. But they literally just had construction worker guys come and pick up trucks and knock on our doors and wake us all up. Which is crazy because they didn't know how late each one of us got there. So I was kind of mad, but at the same time, Okay, I'm first in line, so. <laughs> uh, but he told us, then he brought us here. Apparently, it's like the rules for the permit they got. We were allowed to park at that Walmart. And now they brought us here, so uh, they had to based on the permit. Or I don't freaking know what they were talking about. But we're here, and then now they brought us here, and now they said um, that... They're not going to be here for about 20, 30 minutes, so come on, Lotus. So I think I'm going to start taking my straps off and all that good stuff so I can be ready. Because this guy behind me only has four chains. That's all he's got to take off. And his is a flat load, so he can, like, completely be ready. So I kind of feel bad that we're in first, Zeke. I kind of feel bad that we're in first, Bubbles. So I was kind of mad, y'all, this morning. Because I wanted to go, I was about to get up in like five minutes um, and to let the dogs out and then go inside the Walmart and go grocery shopping and try to find a cooker for my truck to cook food on and then uh, freaking knock on my door, man. Freak. And I, they probably have to escort us back out and they're probably not escorting us back to the Walmart either, so kind of pisses me off, but... I took all my straps off here. I'm leaving my two chains on the ball in the back because that thing will just roll right off my trailer. And I'm keeping two chains, two chains <laughs> on the front, on the front piece right here on the block. And cause he said we're not getting unloaded right here. So I don't know how far we're going or what kind of dirt bumpy road I'm about to be on so I'm gonna just leave that for now setting up the crane in the crane mats so they still have to set everything up to even unload us like why did you even wake us up two freaking hours before you were gonna unload us <laughs> like i could have been shopping at walmart for he some healthy food right now okay okay ziki they didn't mess this up and now i have to wait for him to go bring all the trucks because none of them wanted to follow the girl <laughs> He pulled in front of me and told us to come on and none of all the trucks just stayed there. I was the only one that followed. <laughs> he was like, I guess nobody wanted to follow you. She been like, yeah, it's a female thing. <laughs> they want to feel masculine. <laughs> oh, I asked if I could finish unsecuring. Obviously not the ball because that's just going to start rolling. But, uh, 
He said no, we just leave it. So I went, okay. Whatever. Your girl gotta get out of here. that guys but um i just went and bought a bunch of stuff to be healthier in my truck and to cook and stuff i'm starting to diet so pray for you girl i have to put this stuff away because i'm still waiting on a reload so i just did this while i was waiting so i was kind of in a rush so that's why i didn't um record but i gotta see if all this even fits in my fridge now <laughs> just emptied up my fridge with my soda pops and my vitamin water that has sugar in it it's because i can't have no sugar i'm not gonna have no sugar huh ziki oh, bad, bad. 
So now it's time out with the old and with the new, baby. Yes, sir. You better get off my meat, boy. All right, y'all. Uh, this is the day that I have to mark. Starting over. Trying this diet thing. Trying this diet thing. Huh? We gotta be better. We gotta look better. We gotta be pretty, Ziggy. <laughs> we gotta be healthy. Yeah. With this stuff. Not for you. All right, y'all, so I just did more shopping. Um, I've been waiting for four hours for a reload, but I'm not getting one today. My brother wants to wait tomorrow for possibly a load from my old boss, uh, Bradley. So not where I just currently used to work. Oh, where's my doctor at? Oh, I put, it, I put the other bag. That's the new bag. That's the old bag. Unfortunately, I had to switch their food because uh, they don't sell the high-end food that I buy here for my dog, so as you can see, my truck is crazy, but yeah, I did more shopping, and I don't know if that fridge is going to be able to keep all my stuff cool that I have on there, but I'm going to Deadhead to Oklahoma City, 130 miles, about two hours, and I got some deli meat and some cheese for snacks because I haven't ate yet today, so let's get on down the road, baby. Alright y'all, so I went to a Loves again and they did not have a laundry room. So we stopped in Oklahoma City at the Petro and I just already started my laundry. I'm already getting ready to do my laundry. And uh, <laughs> as you can stare at this guy. Um, I stopped at the Loves about 30 minutes away because I have points at Loves and I wanted to use uh, points for a shower so I didn't have to pay for it. Um, I keep saying, um, I'm sorry guys. And so I went to the Loves and they didn't have a laundry room. You guys, that's the second Loves I tried to go to in the past week to try to take a shower. And So, uh, and then I looked at the Flying J that was after the Loves, and there was reviews saying that the showers and laundry was closed, so I just came to Oklahoma City, because that's where my brother wanted me to come anyways, to try to get a load tomorrow, so, um, is it just me, or do Loves, do Loves not have laundry room? Am I just now finding that out? Somebody please tell me, because I feel like I'm hallucinating, like, I'm in complete shock, I can't believe Loves trucks that don't have laundry rooms. I know some of them do, but I can't believe that some of them don't. It just pissing me off. <laughs> pissing me off. Because I've just been... This is my last clean clothes. Nope. Someone's poop what I didn't pick up. But, uh... I got my bedding and my clothes in there right now, so... We should be good. And then... I haven't ate still today. My head is starting to freaking pound like crazy. I had to let the dogs out and take care of them first and make sure I get some freaking laundry done before I'm walking around smelling like doo-doo stain. I got a lot to try to put together in my truck too. I gotta set up my microwave. I gotta re-put my TV on my wall because it fell off and I had to buy longer screws. So and I'm gonna try to cook today. If it's not too late. I think it's already like probably 6 p.m. Get out of that poop! You wanna get worms, Benjamin? So this is what it's looking like right now, y'all. I'm gonna do a little before and after, <laughs> even though there's not much. That's some more dirty clothes. I have another load I have to do, man. And see my TVs on my bed currently. And there's my new microwave. Woo -woo. I just kind of got all my storage up there now since I'm living on the road. 
now it's kind of like impossible to not use this top bunk for storage I got extra clothes and all that good stuff this is the coffee that my subscriber sent me woo, woo. hey Merlin <laughs> and the coffee pot I haven't opened it yet I'm trying to get everything set up guys you know the dealio you know the dealio So this is what we're about to make guys. I'm probably gonna make some for the week too. So I have a whole package of New York strip steak out. I got my caged eggs and um, got my pan of cooking, heating up some extra virgin olive oil and I got some apple cider vinegar. I'm gonna flavor the meat with it and all this good stuff for her. Go up here and check on a subject. Stand by a vacant building. Ooh, it's kind of different. Uh, the security going. Check and see if got a security I cooked the three steaks. There's one of them, and I'm cooking two eggs because I still haven't ate today. So I put these two in a bag. I'm gonna put them in the fridge once they cool down. And Ooh, we going crab. We go crab. Gotta put these eggs away. Ziki, we just met a follower from our YouTube. We just met a follower, guys. He came up and knocked on my my door. <laughs> that was funny. Um, he seen me walking Benji, but we just took a shower. We are in the truck for the night. Um, hopefully, I'm praying that we get a load tomorrow. Um, I mean, we're gonna get a load, but a, a load decently paying what I want it to pay at least 5000 over the weekend that would be freaking awesome Ziki I'm getting tired of you laying on my pillows you know that I just told you get off my pillow <coughs> you little butthead goes right back on my pillow but I'll see y'all in the morning we're gonna figure out what we're gonna get yes I cook my food I got my microwave we got my TV back up on the mount we're all set we're all ready for the weekend run baby you ready to make some money Ben 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 okay why not y'all this dude <laughs> he just did something nasty I just watched the guy, step deck driver that was parked next to me, just walk out of his truck and dump two whole liters of piss in the grass over there. It's nice to know. Like, that's so disgusting, bro. If I wouldn't even even seen that, I would have been walking Zeke and Benji over there stepping in human piss. And then he seen that I seen him and he he stopped, he like waited for me to get to my truck and he's like, I'm sorry about that. And like, what am I supposed to say? I was just like, oh no, you're fine. And he, he tried, he was like trying to explain to me that it's hard for him and he gets up. Uh, I think he said he gets up throughout the night and has to pee. But I ain't ever seen somebody dump their piss in broad daylight in front of everybody. Zeke, get out of there. That shit was nasty. But we just woke up, y'all. We don't got a load, so my brother's probably trying to find the best possible option for me to run this weekend. So we're being patient. So we're still waiting for a load, guys. I decided to make eggs and bacon, making the bacon first, but 
I tried to set up my coffee maker and I tried to use it. I put the coffee grounds in there and everything in water and it won't start. So I don't know if it works or not. I don't know. It makes me feel stupid. So, oh man, I really wanted a cup of coffee, Ziki. So I guess I jinxed myself yesterday when I said, oh yeah, we're going to get a load, but a decently good paying load for us to run over the weekend. <gasps> yeah, guys, I pretty much um, jinxed myself because we did, in fact, not get a load. We are just chilling here, still at the Oklahoma City Petro. Yeah, without a load, not making no money. I, I haven't been making really good money like the past couple weeks because I've been going to the west so my brother was trying to avoid sending me to the west but avoiding sending me to the west there was that's the only good paying loads that there were out here um, where I'm at in Oklahoma to be honest um so he did not want to take those he was hoping for somebody to come through with a load from Norman Oklahoma but that did not happen today so here we are <sighs> still here my no load <laughs> so since i'm not really gonna have any content to do while i'm here i'm probably gonna end this video here y'all hopefully the next time y'all see me i have a load and i'm making that money hang <laughs> but for now i'll see y'all in the next video much love peace out I say I run it, run it, cause I'm in control Hitting out and couldn't see a couple shots of Patron I ain't feeling night, I get your eyes to pay Party pop, shot a sister coming with me tonight I ain't self-deleting, I ain't snapping and popping Neither I'm bobbing my head